Hey everybody, Landon here. Very serious topic today. It's uh, early in the year, so this time of year a lot of people are focused on losing weight and you know getting in shape and, and New Year's resolutions, so mainly weight discussion kind of things. Uh, this isn't about that at all. I'm, I'm concerned about my guitar weight, right? And so that's what we're going to do here. So sometimes I like to play guitar and have fun. Sometimes I like to just play guitar and not have fun. Or sometimes I just like to have fun. So this is going to be one of those. We're just going to have fun. I'm not going to play guitar. Maybe I'll play guitar. I don't know. Here we go. Here's what we're doing. I'm going to have five guitars that I'm going to show off. And you're going to have to guess which one matches which weight. I'm going to provide the weights. You're going to see the weights of each guitar, but you're not going to know which is which. So let's see if you can do this. For fun. We're having fun, right guys? Okay. All right. First one here. This is a Squire Vintage Modified Jazz Master. And I'm not going to describe the body or anything. You're just going to guess which is which. Okay. Number two. Yeah, that's right. I'm acting. I'm pretending these are heavy because they're actually not. This is a Mexican Telecaster. And you know the Mexican Telecasters, how they are for weight. If I can tell you something. Oh, boy. It's a good workout. Les Paul Custom 77. I don't know if the year matters, but boy, this has some weight. It could be light or heavy. You'll never know. Well, you'll know later. Sorry. All right. Uh, another made in Mexico. Maybe I shouldn't say made in Mexico. Just standard Stratocaster. Standard Strat that's made in Mexico. Okay. Oh, boy. All right, final one here. I've got to actually take a look at this one. This one is a, looks like it's a Rooney Doodle original autographed Irwin Rooney Doodle signed by Rooney Doodle. We all know Rooney Doodle, don't we? Okay, man, holy, oops, so, Let's get the results showing up here. So I'm gonna go from heaviest to lightest, and you're gonna see them now. Here we go. Could you guess which one was the heaviest? Les Paul! Obviously, unless this was a chambered body. Yeah, these things, man, these could break your, your back if you're playing for a while. But they sound awesome, so that's cool. All right, this is kind of unfair. Number two, okay, is actually both of these. Surprisingly, they're identical. And I actually used a scale, so this isn't just a, a joke. They're not joke weights, I didn't make them up. These were exactly the same. So they feel the same too. Okay, that's uh, two and three. This is number four. And you can see the weight on that one. Just a little bit lighter. Okay. And next, last but not least, the Rooney Doodle. Autograph Rooney Doodle. This thing has got to be, you know, this is a collector's item for sure. If you can get your hands on one of these, you're pretty lucky. Well, that's it. I just wanted to have some fun with you. If you didn't have fun with that, then go play guitar and have fun, okay? Anyways, that's it for now. Come back again. I will do some more demos and actually play some real guitar. Just wanted to have a little bit of fun with that one. What's, uh, actually before I go, what's the heaviest guitar you've ever heard of? I know personally, I believe, possibly the heaviest guitar is the George Harrison Rosewood Telecaster. Look it up. Thing's supposed to weigh like 80, uh, George, what? All right, that's it guys, we'll see you later, bye. I know.
What you gonna say?